Welcome back to the channel everyone. If you joined us in last week's video, you would have seen that we have moved to this beautiful part of Scotland called the Ardner Merkin Peninsula. Today is an absolutely gorgeous day, so we're actually going to head to a really amazing sounding beach called the Singing Sands. There's a beach on Isla that's also amazing with the same name. Um, they're not related. They're not related. <laughs> <laughs> they both have sand though. Yeah. Um, so we're going to go there today. It's a bit of a walk, it's about an hour, but yeah, we're going to make the most of this absolutely cracking, cracking day. And I think this is a perfect opportunity to introduce a new member of our family. Say hi to Glenn. Glenn the car. Glenn the car, named after, after Glenn from The Walking Dead. And the reason why we decided to get a car is because I can't drive the van and also the van is really big. I don't think we will, would be able to park here. No. So it just makes our life a bit easier since we're gonna spend the summer here. And also I can't drive the van. You said that. Oh, you already said that. <laughs> <laughs> Glenn, is... welcome. Well, welcome Glenn to the welcome, channel. Welcome Glenn. So I think we should leave now. Yes, okay. Okay, go. bye. Bye. And I'm saying we bought a car. I should really say a big thanks to my old man, my dad, because he was actually the one that bought the car and he got a really tip top deal on this little belter of a car so thanks dad it's actually your car because i haven't paid you for it yet <laughs> but yeah our car <laughs> so again if you joined us in last week's video we did go to like a really fantastic beach the more kind of common beach the most famous beach which is sana bay this, however, I have yet to meet met someone that's went, oh, I went to Singing Sands and it was so great. But I think that's purely just because of its location and its remoteness. Look at us with our mic. Such I, professionals now. Yeah, such professionals. Um, it's like we're reporters. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's... Um, we, we're trying to make the audio sound a lot better. And when we walk, when we have it clipped, it doesn't sound too great, so... Yeah, I do apologise. <laughs> walking <laughs> I love the thing. So we've been walking for half an hour or so. Something like that, yeah. I think. And uh, it's just such a beautiful walk. The road is in a really con good condition as well. There's a few houses around. A few, much more. Few. Yeah, just, just a few. <laughs> and now we entered a forest. And I think. Once, once we go through the forest, there should be the beach. If you just keep following the road, you eventually see a sign for beach. We're going that way. That way. This is so nice. The sand is incredibly soft. Yeah, it is. Wow, look. It's windy. It is windy. Wow, how nice is this? Wow. This is wow. Let's head over there. Yeah, let's try to sit. Rox, are you ready? <clears throat> are you ready to be embarrassed with your screams like I was last week? You'll be, think, you'll be screaming inside. I think I think I can show you who's a who's a harder person. Well, on you go. You can be first. Go <laughs> on you go. Hard man. Well, I don't know if you can hear us, but this is really nice. And it's not as cold as a... Not, it's, honestly, it's not nearly as cold as it was the other day when I went in in last week's vlog. Yeah, this um, is, wow. The water's, yeah, it's crystal oh. clear. It's really not that cold. No jellyfish. Cool. Get, yes. get in there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo. Look all around us. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. 
if anyone wonders why we move out to places like this, it's for days like this. Woohoo! I'm just so surprised how nice it was to be in the water. I thought it would be a hell of a lot colder. Yeah. Super nice. There is something really nice when you have rocks on the beach. You know, you don't have to sit on the sand. And then you can have like little private beaches because there's a group over there and there's a group behind. It's actually busy on the beach than I thought it would be because it's quite a walk. Yeah. And you were surprised how many kids are on the beach if they had to walk all the way here. Yeah. Um, but yeah, someone over there. There's nobody around there. But there must be about another... For groups, I've seen yeah. busy, it's probably about 20 people on the beach. Yeah. But you can get your own beach. It's... And you just come around the rocks a wee bit. So, I think we know why this beach is called the Singing Sands. I'm gonna demonstrate it to you. Sorry if it's a bit weird, but listen to this. This is another demonstration. Follow my food. Okay, so this is a demonstration when you just walk. Yeah, if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> I do apologize for the strange content. Hope you enjoy. So before we left we thought, or I thought, <laughs> that'd be nice just to walk round the corner, climb, scramble across the rocks, and then when we got round here we were greeted with another spectacular beach. But yeah, and then rocks is on the Google Maps, checking where we are, and then it looks as though round the corner there's another massive beach, which is exciting, but that's for another day because, what time is it? It's just after six o'clock. Let's go. Let's go. Lovely. Walk. Come on. Let's, let's you go. Need to go. You need to walk aesthetically for the vlog. Woke up this morning to be greeted by another absolutely gem of a day. Absolutely amazing. Uh, so the plan for today is to do a wee bit of the same as yesterday. Chill out, um, enjoy this amazing park up. So this is a park up we've came to a few times because it's fairly level and there's many places for people to park. But you're also right next to Loch Sunard, which is uh, it's pretty perfect, eh, Rox? Oh, beautiful. So nice. So we're going to use this paddle board that I stole from my brother Daniel. Thank you, Daniel. And we're going to go and enjoy the lock. Here we go. Well, here goes nothing, should I say. Here goes nothing. No, I'm not. No, I mean, you just need to <laughs> How beautiful is that? Be able to see them. Yeah, what so yeah, we're surrounded by jellyfish. Um, I do feel like humans are the happiest when they're in nature. Yeah, it's so we true. are a part of nature. There's nothing better. I mean, look at that. It doesn't get better than that, guys. Ah, Carlo. I would also like to say that we really need to find some friends. People who are our age. So if there's any followers here who are around 30, you can come and join us. What if he means it's 25? We are closer, we're closer to 25? We're closer no, we're not. To 30. Oh. <laughs> Hello, so true. It's, it's the same person. <laughs> yeah. I think 
this is a, a nice reminder that you don't actually need much in life. Yeah, we definitely don't. You know, you don't need a lot of money to enjoy these things. And sometimes we have little, then you can enjoy things. Yeah. Like some blue cheese. It's like, oh, we spent three pounds on cheese. Three pounds? Yeah. Um, and the views, man. Yeah. It's, it's the nature. Until the midges come out, then yeah. it's hell. <laughs> <laughs> We are a week later. We've just been a bit busy doing other stuff, and we're currently parked up in our actually probably the favorite place on the peninsula. Uh, I mean, I don't think we really have to explain why. You can see the view behind me, uh, but it's really funny because we've been here a lot of the times, but we never actually mentioned this place in our video. So today is the day. Uh, so Callum is currently at work. Um, and once he's back, we're actually gonna go back to the same spot where we were paddleboarding and we have some friends coming over tomorrow, Phil and Sharon. So yeah, we should have a really nice weekend. So I'm back to the van, I'm just doing some work and I actually forgot to mention that we discovered a really beautiful place, a beautiful beach a couple of days ago. Um, so we drove to Sana, we parked the car uh, and instead of going to the main beach, we decided to go to the right side. There's some really cool cliffs um, and after walking for about half an hour through quite a difficult terrain, we also had to cross the river, uh, just out of nowhere there was this beach. Just beautiful water, crystal clear. Uh, the sand was very nice as well. Nobody was there except for loads of seals. Um, so we went for a swim. Obviously it was really warm that day. I don't think you can find it on Google Maps. I had a quick, quick glance uh, on the maps. So maybe the tide comes in and you maybe you're not able to get there. Uh, not really sure. Um, but yeah, it was really beautiful. Um, so the plan is Callum will be back from work. We're going to head back to the same spot, as I mentioned, where we were paddleboarding. And our friends, Phil and Sharon, are going to come and join us tomorrow. Um, uh, I, they, they have a YouTube channel as well. They're traveling a lot. Uh, we met them actually on YouTube, but in person we met them on Isla when we lived on Isla, which was really cool. Um, so yeah, I think they're just coming for a longer weekend. We're going to have a nice campfire on the beach, probably have some nice whiskey, some nice food. So yeah, that's pretty much the plan. So, yeah. So yeah, Sharon and uh, Phil have made it to the Ardenmark and they were actually here last night and so it's nice, we've been catching up, had a, a wee dram already and we thought it'd be a nice idea to have a, a wee fire on the beach um, and we were actually going to try and attempt to cook our, our vegan burgers on, on the fire. Will that be a fail? Probably, but we're going to try and as always with us, using whiskey barrel bits. We win. Say <laughs> <laughs> when. Say when. It's a big glass. Keep going. Thanks, Phil. Whenever Thank we have friends you. visiting, and I this whiskey that Phil poured us is tip top. It's actually a new single cask in the distillery, and it's full of PX sherry, six year old, and it's to die for. So, I'm just looking at my burgers and yeah, I was too busy talking to the nice people parked uh, beside us and 
they're burnt. I'm pretty sure they are probably solid, but too much of a chatterbox. My usual problem. There was lightning! Do you see the lightning? <laughs> did you capture lightning? Did you capture it? I did. Roxana looks like a Greek god. Rox, give me your best Greek god impression. What? Give me a Greek god pose. Uh, You're a Greek god. Dark for everyone. Not the relaxing guys. Thank God. Yeah. It's another beautiful morning. It's a wee bit rainy last night, but this morning it's so nice. It's nice. And we just say goodbye to uh, Sharon and Phil and the life of Riley. But we had such a nice night. We didn't video much because we're just chatting, debating, all the good stuff. But we thought this would be a nice way to end the video. Do you want to say the whole thank you for watching? Yes. Uh, I'm still very oh, sleepy. I'm still asleep. Um, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, and we will see you next Monday. Slange Mata. Slange. Can you do that with me? Yeah, it works. Cheers guys. Mm -hmm. So this is not actually the proper road. We're just doing this for a shot.